I see really three main challenges for consumer product companies and brands. First of all, the geopolitical crisis continue into 2024. And this impacts brands' total addressable market and disrupts their supply chains. Also, the cost of living crisis is still impacting consumers. They express concerns about their financial situation. I think the changing consumer behavior, rapidly changing consumer behavior, is going to put a lot of pressure on consumer product companies and brands, and it is going to test their ability to react fast. The trend towards white label or, or, or private label is, is certainly an extension of the cost of goods that, that's out there. And so people are looking for their low cost, low cost solutions for some of the same essentials that they need to have day to day. And so the challenge is, is how do the brands differentiate themselves? Now, consumer product companies and brands need to look at ways to step up transformation. They need to find ways to take the costs out using advanced technology, such as traditional AI or generative AI uh, technologies. A good example is doing demand forecasting so that they can better understand the buying patterns of consumers and they can predict it. There's a gap between desire of the consumer in sustainability and action. Uh, and that action and that delta is based upon price. If, if I have to pay more for sustainability, there's only so much I'm willing to do. Where the consumer product companies are going for, and, and retail is focusing on how to create sustainable products that can be actually cost efficient. One of the first areas the brand companies and consumer products should look into is their suppliers. They need to have a variety of suppliers they can source sustainable ingredients from and they need to help those suppliers scale with them. A few of our customers are talking about omni-channel or connected commerce and how different channels come together. And I think alongside the consumer experience, it is critical to join the physical experience as well from an omni-channel perspective. So whether it's shopping on um, online commerce channels, looking at B2B options, CPG companies have to invest in making that shopping experience and fulfillment a seamless experience.